Alrighty, happy Saturday night. A small crowd advisory and a gale warning are both up here. The gale warning indicated in this color here and further off to the south and west is lighter color indicating that small crowd advisory. Both will expire at 7 a.m. as we head towards your Monday. Wave heights already busy out there though at around four to nine feet and even higher surf being noted further down to the south. So we we're dealing with some active surf out there across the region with an area low pressure not too far away. On land though, we've been very limited to clouds. So a good amount of sunshine today with a few passing clouds have been common across the region. The main activity again further off towards the east and we'll stay rather quiet with the exception of the wind though. We'll be watching for some gusty winds moving forward as well with low pressure that's off to the east and high pressure not too far away either. High pressure will help to keep us dry as we do move forward over the next few days. So future gas moving forward though we'll be watching this system off toward the east as well helping to pick our winds up but we will stay quiet otherwise though filled with a lot of sunshine as we head to things for your Sunday maybe a few passing clouds in the eastern parts of the state even by Sunday night starting off most We'll see clear, but some clouds do start to move in, though, as we head towards Monday morning. Here it is right about in here, maybe in the down east parts of the state, watching for a little bit of cloud cover. By that point, we notice some more clouds begin to move in by Monday afternoon. So overall, we'll call it a party cloudy sky in some spots. But we want to watch for the gusty winds as well. Even later on tonight, some spots getting up to around 20, even 30 miles per hour at times. Even as we head towards your Sunday, some gusty winds getting up to around 30 miles per hour will be possible at time zone. And even by Sunday night, look at this gusty winds continue reaching up to about 30 miles per hour. This is all thanks to that system that's further off towards the east. But otherwise, so another look at those high temperatures today. We made it up into the upper 20s. So overall, not too bad, though. We had some lower 30s further off towards the south and west. And overall, well, I'll even step off the screen so you can see this here. Overall, the past several days, though, we've had temperatures just well above normal in the 30s. Maybe a few sporadic days in the 20s. But overall, we've been warm. Our average high temperature should be 29 degrees. We'll do about that for tomorrow, though, in the upper 20s. The lower 30s Monday into Tuesday. We're back in the mid 30s Wednesday. Wednesday, upper 30s Thursday. Look at this. Some 40s return a warm up on the way by Friday and a Saturday of next week. Longer term forecast for February 9th through the 13th. Kind of confirming that, though, what we will be seeing. Good probabilities of us being above average. Those 40s will be on the way, though. That will be above our average highest. So we'll have to watch for that warmer weather moving forward. And probabilities, though, some areas may have equal opportunities of being either above or below average for the precipitation. But anywhere you see green, though, helping to indicate some parts of the country will have opportunities to be above average with regards to precipitation. This will be for February 9th through the 13th. So overall for tonight, nine degrees, mostly clear, becoming breezy out there with that north wind getting up to about 20 miles per hour at times. As we head towards tomorrow, upper 20s, mostly sunny and windy out there. With that north wind getting up to about 30 miles per hour at times. Here's looking at extended forecast. Look at this. So partly cloudy as we head towards your Monday with highs in the low 30s, lower 30s again for a Tuesday with a partly cloudy sky, mostly sunny on Wednesday, highs in the mid 30s and upper 30s Thursday with a partly cloudy sky. Guy.